Hi guys, this is JC. Welcome to the January Dual Universe Update Diary. I hope you had a great vacation and I wish you all a very happy new year. On our side, lots of exciting new stuff. I'm going to get to that in a moment. But before that, keep in mind that everything we show uh, is still work in progress, pre-alpha. Uh, most of the elements and UI are placeholder, non-final. So, that being said, let's just dive right in. On the rendering side, we've been working on a new desert biome, as well as a first iteration of an IC biome that will be used to generate polar caps. We started to play with the first version of the day-night cycle, mostly to work on the global illumination during the night, so that you can see a little bit in the dark. The smoother tool is now in place and will allow to sculpt the voxels with even more possibilities. We have also extended the undo feature to be able to work with the smoother. We worked on the functioning range of the jetpack with a special mode within a building zone of a construct to allow the player to move around easily and access all parts of the construct while in build mode. On the physics side, we now have engines with actual forces that are applied where the engine is. So you need to position your engines in a logical way if you want to push your craft in a given direction. Certain engines generate a force which decreases with altitude, so you can build a nice floating hovercraft like this one. We have also further worked on the actual in-game rendering of the nanoformer. This is still work in progress, but as you can see, we intend to have part of the UI integrated directly into the nanoformer. Finally, we have also set up our first live test server with hundreds of bots running on it non-stop. The dev team can connect on it to test stability and check the gameplay in a loaded environment. We will gradually increase the stress on the server to test the game in more and more complex scenarios. That's it for now. Thanks for watching and thanks to our ever-growing number of crowdfunding backers. See you next month for lots of new cool stuff.